And so Parkinson's disease is a neurodegenerative disease. It is observed as being a set of um, motor symptoms. So what that means is that people will experience uh, rest, tremor. Um, uh, people will have also freezing of movements. Okay, so they'll have difficulty moving, walking. Uh, work generally on a set of proteins uh, that are involved in what we call uh, quality control. And these proteins are able to sort the damaged protein from the non-damaged proteins. And they send the damaged one for to be degraded. And that's important for the uh, long-term survival of neurons. So the protein that I have uh, studied uh, here uh, is called PACRG. But what we found is that the protein is involved in uh, forming a part of a cell called a cilium. It's a little appendage that comes out from every cell. And these appendages are involved in many things. So we have a lot of cilia and flagella everywhere. Our brain has little flagella that moves the cerebrospinal fluid inside your brain. Okay, so they're super important. I, I love the CLS. <laughs> I love the CLS. It's, it, it's fantastic. So there are definitely experiments that we cannot do um, without the CLS. So my research program ha actively looks for, par for small molecules that could be potential drug targeting parking and, and pink one. PACRG is not the, same, the kind of protein that is amenable to drug design. Although we, we never know. We're, we're sometimes very bad at predicting the future this way, right? And sometimes discoveries come from completely unsuspecting uh, direction. Do good science, do report on things that are real and, and, and important. And later on, people might figure out how, what might, might be its best use.